Each spring, the town of Oravel celebrates the fact the Feather River runs right through its historic downtown. The celebration runs for a full week, and the river is called the Feather River. Welcome to Feather Fiesta Day. The celebration kicked off this year on May 3rd with the 9th annual Oraville Beer Fest, put on by the native sons of the Golden West. This year it moved to a new location in the historic downtown district, and the weather was perfect. During the week there was a community concert and an open house and a tea at the historic Chinese temple. On Friday, May 9th, it was the 67th annual Kiwanis Kitties Parade. This year's theme was Gone Fishing. Generations have walked in this time-honored event, bringing both young and old out to celebrate the community. It's a great family tradition and just about the cutest thing you ever saw. The Big Day hits on Saturday, May 10th, kicked off by the Exchange Club's Grand Parade. The parade parallels the Feather River along historic Montgomery Street with its beautiful Victorian homes and parks. This year, there were over 70 different entries with over 100 vehicles, including floats and boats and acrobats, vintage cars, four marching bands, and dancers of all kinds. Did I mention the Oro Dam Cruisers Gold Rush Car Show? Over 800 of the finest buggies from across the West came together and the place just shined. There were muscle cars, vintage rides, souped up hot rods, and restored classics. From the fine to the funky, there was a car for everyone. The Lot Home hosted the Oroville Docents Craft Fair with wonderful handmade crafts. And in the heart of Oroville, you found the Gold Rush Fair, with over 75 booths, with everything from food to gifts, all presented by the Oroville Downtown Business Association. There was also a chili cook-off with live entertainment, chili and beer produced by the Oroville Firefighters Association. St. Thomas of the Apostles School had a family fair with games, booths, food, and refreshments. And the artists of Rivertown held an art exhibit on the levee. Feather Fiesta Day's committee would like to take a moment to thank Mike Ish of the Oroville Downtown Business Association for all her efforts and years of service. She has graciously given to this and to so many other community events. Next year, she says she'll be a spectator. Hats off to you, Mike, and thanks for all you do for the community. And of course, none of this would be possible without the contributions of the SBF Fund, Department of Water Resources, the City of Oroville, the Oroville Chamber of Commerce, and all our wonderful sponsors, thank you for another fabulous Feather Fiesta Days.